Hello, welcome to my studio. My name is Mary Therese Ross. I'm a sculptor. I live here in London. I also make paintings and I draw. I make collages, print make, all sorts of things. I try and make objects or things that have a meaning, a substance, an integrity. My sculptures are principally made of wood, um, but I also incorporate all sorts of other elements and use other materials. Uh, the other elements are not always, but quite often found objects, so ladders, feathers, all sorts of things. And I usually paint my sculptures. That sort of gives it a sense of unity. My work is, tends to be quite large, or at least human scale, although I personally am not a very large or big person. Um, I feel scale is quite important. I studied painting at undergraduate, and when I studied painting, we, the painters, looked down on the sculptors and said that the sculptures were things that people bumped into when they were looking at the paintings. So I was a bit of a snob, but now I am the sculptor, and my feeling is always to make sure that my sculpture has a presence so that it isn't something that people just merely trip over. They are aware of it as being not part of the environment, but perhaps invading the environment. My inspirations come from many places, but I suppose I could quite easily say there are two main sources. One is literature, and I've always loved reading. And as a child, the things I was reading were inspiring ideas because for me, it was a very visual process. And then, of course, as somebody who works in museums, um, as somebody who is very aware of the history of art, um, so many artists influence me. So many artists give me ideas that uh, it's hard to pick out one over another. My studio, I suppose, is a you know collage of postcards and visual ideas from other artists. Alors, du point de vue littérature, comme j'ai dit avant, j'ai toujours beaucoup lu et il y a eu des livres qui m'ont beaucoup inspiré. Par exemple, même Le Petit Prince, c'était un livre que j'adorais avec les petits dessins dedans. D'autres livres, c'est pas l'histoire, c'est l'ambiance parfois, euh, parfois un personnage et parfois c'est simplement. Euh, l'expérience d'avoir lu ce livre qui influence euh, mes sculptures et mon art. This is called Cubist Portrait of My Mother. Um, it came about because I was looking at Marcel Duchamp and his new Descending the Staircase. And I was very intrigued by the whole idea of making something 3D talk about movement. I wanted the figure not to be going down the stairs, but somehow it related to my mother who had a leg that she couldn't bend. And because she couldn't bend her leg, she would perch on the edge of seats. So I liked the idea of the figure almost looking like she's about to stand up. So she's got her legs st straight out, a reference to my mother, and then the two back legs are the stool, and then there's this second leg here, which is a dowel with a leg. So it was the two ideas, the personal story, my mother, and the formal idea found in art, Marcel Duchamp, that came together. And that's also what influenced the colors that I chose for this piece. <laughs> 